Good afternoon YouTube. So back with another video. This is going to be the first video in the Must Learn KQL series. So basically what I'm doing is making a companion series to Rod Trent's blog series that you can see here. He also has an ebook that he's keeping updated so you can get this all in a PDF format. I will put all these links down in the description. So there's the aka.ms Must Learn KQL that'll bring you here. And then this table of contents here is everything he has done so far. So I'm a little behind on videos. The first two I'm not going to make a video on because we're not really in any of the code there. So make sure you read through parts one and two. There are some good nuggets in there. I'm going to start right here with the workflow and then basically we're going to just learn through this together because I know a little bit about KQL. Not to be dangerous, uh, but I'll be learning right along with you with this series. So if you feel like joining me, feel free to do so. If you have any comments or questions, Feel free to leave them down in the comments. I may or may not be able to answer, but I'll do my best. So until the next video, take care.